bit more about your third principle? Yes. So the third principle is the mind. The first two principles was, were the breath work, breathing, meditation, and now the mind. And I'm a strong believer, and also with my own experience, that if uh, you first don't connect with yourself, with your being, with your soul, it's almost impossible to work with the mind. So we first need the light, like we need more light, we need more awareness, which comes with breath work and meditation, to be able to consciously start working with our minds. It's very different, like I think there are two types of people, people who are more aware, who have more awareness, who have been you know, doing meditation, spending time with themselves, doing some breath work, and people who are less aware, who have more biases, more judgments in their mindset. And it's hard for me as a teacher, as a mentor to work with the second type of people. That's why I ask for first people to start with breath work and meditation, and then we start with mind work. So what we do on the mind level, what we do in the awakening process, is basically working with humans' biases and humans' judgments and perceptions. Humans are extraordinary because it's kind of like life is happening on one side and then we have all kinds of perceptions, all kinds of ideas, all kinds of thoughts about life which affects our behaviors and who we are, which actually limits ourselves and we don't even realize. Like most of our belief systems most of the ideas we have about life, most of the thoughts like this is right, this is wrong, I should be doing this, I shouldn't be doing this, this whole thing about perceptions is actually limiting our lives beyond our perceptions, beyond our, you know, beyond the way we can even think about it, beyond the way we can see it. And for me to support any individual to live an extraordinary life. If I want to get people to uh, get to a place where they can grow and expand in all areas of their lives, I first need to work with their perceptions, their judgments, their biases, and their misperceptions, basically, and get them to a more balanced mind state. And I've been using different uh, modalities, different methods for transforming the mind. There are a lot of popular methods, popular modalities. And I have found one amazing method which covers everything, which helps people, uh, he, which helps me as a mentor and teacher get people to where I want to get to, to that balanced mindset where you can see what is real, you can move beyond your perceptions. And that's De Martini method that has been created by Dr. De Martini. So I teach my students the De Martini method and the awakening the process covers a whole journey with live and online course series and also mentoring sessions which I, where I teach the Martini method. It's a method basically to help people move beyond their perceptions, beyond their misperceptions and get them to a more balanced mindset so that they can experience their geniusness, so that they can experience their um, uh, power and their creative and manifestation power in themselves. And I would like to read a short, brief description of the Martini method from Dr. De Martini's website because I think they are the best in explaining the De Martini method. The De Martini method is a breakthrough discovery and a cutting-edge personal transformation methodology which results in a new perspective and paradigm in thinking and feeling. So it's basically this. It is the culmination of Dr. De Martini's 36 years of research and studies in numerous disciplines, including including physics, physiology, theology, metaphysics, psychology, astronomy, mathematics, neurology, and physiology. The Martini method is a procedure that neutralizes an individual's emotional charges, so it's basically neutralizing our charges and balancing our perceptions, balances his or her mental and physical reactions, opens his heart, clears his or her mind. It is the most powerful, effective, efficient technology of personal methodology in personal transformation we as Nefsha Institute ever came up with, with working with different methods and it's taught in more than 58 countries around the world. So basically, the method, first of all, awakens the mind, awakens the mind to an underlying hidden order which appears, uh, which changes the whole perception of the world you live in and it starts transforming your behaviors, your thoughts, your perceptions. I think 
most of you know that awakening happens in the mind, so it's mostly a work in the mind that transforms the perception and helps you reawaken to your truth, to what the reality of the world is, and to reawaken to your geniusness. And people who have worked with the mind, had uh, worked with this method, had extraordinary transformations in their lives. That's why we have came up with a unique formula with, like I said, an online home study series, the Demartini Method Intensive Training, which is a two-day workshop, live Demartini Method uh, coaching, and also mentoring sessions, one-on-one -on -one mentoring sessions, and also we give you the awakening book as a bonus. And uh, I do have a wealth building workshop and a business workshop. You can immediately uh, start after this training because it's included in the package. And there are topics like health, wealth, business, relationships, and also the application of the whole uh, method. And it's just amazing to be uh, you know, part of this whole uh, environment, watching people heal and watching people transform their mindset. Because the moment your mind gets transformed, your life also gets transformed. And this is the third principle. The fourth principle is uh, connecting with who you are, knowing your human design, knowing your values, knowing your purpose. Uh, aligning your life with your life purpose, aligning your goals, your perspectives, and also your objectives with your purpose. And I'm going to be explaining that, that in the next part.